Hi, this is Robin Moses, and I'm going to be doing The Little Mermaid, only in the evil version. So what I'm doing is I'm starting with um, Ursula. And, um, your brush, you would make her little tiny, like little palm like this, and then finger, 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 okay? And then I'm going to do the other side. Okay, now with um, a gray, a light, light gray, I'm going to go in and do um, her hair. Well, that's medium. Let me add a little bit more. Okay. Like this. And we are going to put in her hair. This. This. And it's going to fly just around like this. Uh, very whimsical. No. Rhyme. Okay, now I'm going to add the blue. The blue I have, let me show you my palette. Okay, the blue I have is right here. It's uh, blue and black mixed together, and that will be Ursula's um, eyebrows. So I'm going to go back in and create a better area for her hairline. Then dry. While I let that dry, I'm going to go back in and with um, black, I'm just going to push in as if she has tentacles. And they're going to go, like, they're going to be like a, like a mirage. Like, like, there's not going to be any way for you to see where or how they start. So, this is going to outline her, the black of her hand, etc. Okay, now with um, blacker color, okay, with her her black eyeshadow, I'm going to go in and I am going to like cut in just little half moons right here. And then that is where her eyeshadow goes. Then I'm going to go in. Now this is like a really super tiny, like super, super, super tiny. So I understand if you guys can't do this. Then with this, you're going to go in and do like two little eyes like that. Okay. Now the, the black eyeshadow, it makes kind of like her mean brow. So it goes down, 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 down. And then comes up and then down, down, down. Down, down. Okay. Like that. And then um, I, I, I did the lips and I forgot to put that on camera. But you just kind of do the same thing as what I'm doing here is I just outlined it with a dark red. And then there's that. And um, with little tiny dots, you do the little eyes. And um, okay, with the light blue again, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna keep on working this this brown line because getting the brown line right is making sure that she looks evil. See, when I move this brown line inward, like dink dink, like like a U. See how it gives her a dirty, like a mean look. That's what you want. You don't want it to be like uh, a nice look. So that would be like that. And see that little tiny error? That just totally messed up her brow. So there we go. And then with white, you're going to come back in and you're going to highlight into her hairline. And that's where you get to really like draw her hair in. So you go like this. Like this. That. Okay? Nose. Easy cheeks cheeks and then her chin goes here and then I'm going to just highlight all where her um, shoulders are so that it looks like she's just coming behind herself so that she's head first into this nail like that like cheese like that this okay so there she is and I think I'm going to just do a, like a little tiny 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 highlight right in the center to give her like eyeshadow and with the very littlest dots ever dot 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 there's her eye eyelashes and um okay now only like if you're professional don't try this if you're new but with the tiniest black line ever go across with the tiniest line ever 
want to just dot, 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 because she just has little things right here. So you just want to show those just barely. You have to have really thin black too, and if you get caught, that's because your black's too thick. And I think that's done for here, and I'm going to go through with lighter and finish her. She's going to be like a zombie Ariel, and I am going to push in. I kind of want her head to be big. Arms. And shoulders. And she's going to be holding that fish. Who's that? What's that fish's name? Flounder. Flounder. She's going to be holding flounder and um, in this way. Okay. So I'm taking her arm through. Her her uh, her arm is coming up and then around here. Now in through here. I'm going to make a green and a white, and I'm going to mix in the flounder. So here's flounder, uh, and I kind of, I need them a little bit more olive. Okay, so flounder's going to look like this, and, and flounder too is evil. So we are going to push him in like this, and like this. Okay, now his, um, his bottom jaw is going to come come up through here like this. Okay, then with little white teeth, here we go, little white teeth, I'm going <laughs> to, let's edit that out. <laughs> I'm sorry, but it's funny to me, these little white teeth, I, I, they're so tiny. Okay, hold on, a little, oh, okay, one. With little white teeth, we're gonna go through here like this. And that's gonna be like that, okay? Now I have to go back over and and like go like this, and go like this, and see how it fixes all that. Then I'm gonna go back in with his eye. It's gonna be evil. And then I'm gonna let that dry for a minute. Go back over here, and then I'm gonna paint in her dark red hair. And I'm going to make like red and black mixed together and put in her background hair. And her background hair is just going to be freaking wild, okay? And it's going to just be like the devil hair. Devil hair and Ariel. To take this, okay, here we go. So I'm going to multi-layer this. So here is her hair coming like this, and it's going to... It's going to emulate the um, the tentacles that Ursula has so that the whole design comes together as a unit and it will be her hair and the tentacles as one kind of design background. Okay, so it's going to look like that. Okay, and then on the thumb I am going to spread it completely, turn the, I'm going to pretend like this is her fin, right? And then I'm going to make the fin like this, okay? So this would be her fin. Now I'm going to make fire. So So she's going to be evil there. Oh, this is going to be like really super cute too when I'm done. Okay, hold on. So we're going to, that needs to dry a little bit too. But I just need to get the colors in. That. Okay. And I need to stick the color in here. Fire. Fire. Dot, 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 dot. Up here. Fire, fire, and then I'm going to go in. I mean, it's almost like the, the flames are just going to shoot into the tail onto the onto the um, thumbnail. Okay, so this is just like the beginning of her tail coming out. So it's not going to be it's not going to have a uh, shape yet. Okay, now for her hair, it's dry. So you got to go in with um, 
her orange hair because Ariel has really like orangey hair and again we're going to pick it up okay okay and we're going to go in with like orangey red Ariel has orangey hair you don't want a two orange or else it's going to match the tail fire and it's not going to match it's going to it's not going to look like two separate entities so you want it to be this to be more of a cherry red and the tail to be an orange red and it will just it'll just trust me it'll keep things separated now you want to have her her shells on her on her bra to be the same color as um as your ursula so that your your whole um your whole design will start to come together so we're going to do that and I'm going to add a little bit of red right here and then go like this, like this, okay and then we're going to have that and let that dry. Okay, now, um, now I'm going to do her arm. Now look at this. The arm goes and then it comes to here. Okay, so you drag it out to the other side like this, okay? And then I am going to <laughs> She has little tiny like bandages that are holding on her arm, okay? And so I am doing this. And can someone look up the artist for this? While we're, while, yeah, that's fine. That's the one we already had on there. Yeah, I forgot and I threw that away. I want to give the artist credit. Um, and then from Jeffrey this... Jeffrey Thomas. Yeah, Jeffrey Thomas drew this. And um and mine isn't exactly like Jeffrey Thomas's and you know etc cetera, etc. Cetera. I took like a couple of different pictures and made it into one, but um for the most part it, it was what we said. Oh wow, I want to do something like this. So Jeffrey Thomas, it, it, uh, look up his art because it's really cool. And um, okay, so here is the bandages, and um, then it goes like this, and like this, and it's like her fork is her arm. So there is that. <laughs> it's so evil. Sorry in advance. Really. Okay. So let's see. Um, with this one in like this, I make her little eyebrows. Let me zoom. Okay. I'm going to make her little eyebrows and then I'm going to make her little eyes like so. Go in, touch your other shoulder in, boom, 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 gotcha, and then, then with her fingers, with that same white, I'm going to go in, and I put little, I put little tiny uh, nails on there, so I just put little, and now I'm turning her into a zombie color as a top uh, highlighter, so there's that, and then just kind of tap, Happen. like that and just make some just make some flame just kind of create a flame like tail and if you don't know how to just copy what I'm doing just just keep rewinding and copy what I'm doing because it just takes practice and this is a lemon yellow and I'm going to top coat maybe with a little bit of glitter on this as well Okay, now with um, Ina's Glam Rock, I'm going to go over and I'm going to hit the bottom areas with that I have used with my new favorite glue ever called the best glue ever, right? The best glue ever. Because it is. Because it is. And they're not paying me to say that. It's because it freaking rocks. And there we go. I'm going to go through with this. And I'm just going to hit and bully in all of the areas that I want the water to show. And go around her face. 
And I've just made her look like she was swimming in water. Yeah, there we go. See her? Okay, I'm going to go in with red, and I'm just going to touch all the places that I hit with the glue for her hair. And what I did was I just went with the foil glue in the same area in the round circles that I did on her hair highlights, and I'm highlighting. Excuse me, and I'm highlighting her hair with that same um, Inaz, um uh, Crimson Glam is what I'm using for the hair to be done with. Okay, now here we go. Here we go. With Crimson Glam, I'm going to touch in to the red areas. See? Let me file in there. Okay. It's too far. Okay. With Crimson Glam, I'm going to go in there and just touch in with red. Okay? Watch. Touch in, touch in, touch in, touch in like this. Okay? Now, with um, Glam Rock, I'm going to go in and I'm going to hit the other ones so that it's just going to be one huge fire ball explosion on this nail. I want it to look like, what the hell? That's what I want it to look like. Okay? With no rhyme, but it's going to make sense. And then I'm going to take the, the crimson, I mean the glam, and then I'm going to take it all the way out this way. See? So it's like the fire starts, boom, it comes right here, boom, ends here, boom, the end. That's how I want it to look. And then like this, okay? Okay, and here is the end product. Let me zoom, out, zoom down so that you can see. And there is um, Ursula, and she's carried out into the other nails, and there's her tentacles. And here is the scary, freaky zombie Ariel holding the flounder. And then you see her arm, it turns into a little fork right there, because she's a little zombie fork poker. And then her, her, um, her tail goes into fire. And then, can you show me your thumb? Yeah, just, just flip it over so I can show. Yeah. And then the tail finally just ends up in a big flame of fire, which is really super cool. So, so if you can, um, if you can't see these nails really well because of the, uh, the colors, please visit my blog or my Facebook, and I will have better pictures for you there. And thank you so much for watching, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye, everyone say bye. Bye! bye.